Hello, and welcome back to Virtue's Last Reward. I'm your host, Elizabeth Princess, in the last episode. We started down a new timeline. That means this should be going so much quicker, right? I can, I can skip a lot of stuff. Things like Alice stabbing herself and everything. That should just work out, right? Right? In this episode, I guess we find out. Ooh. Uh, another elevator, you huh? think it works? Oh god, it already starts. <laughs> I don't know. Only one way to find out, though. Hey, someone's yeah. coming. Oh man, someone. <laughs> oh Indeed, no. Clark and Ten no, no, no. I feel like I'm not gonna be able to skip anything. <sighs> <sighs> Am I seriously? What's going on here? Am I seriously just gonna have to do the fucking ellipses and panting every time? We ran into them a little bit ago. Well, not literally, of course. I don't know. With a prowl like that, I imagine you run into a lot of things. What the fuck does that mean? Let me see the map. Uh, sure. Oh my god, please. Don't do this to me. I get it. All three routes that end up here. That's the same as the map we found in the infirmary. Infirmary. Oh, we found a map like that too. Ours was in the crew quarters. Oh, it's all new because I went to the crew quarters. No. <laughs> That so. You found ours in the lounge. Hmm. Maybe we should sit down for a bit and exchange information. Oh no. No. But it's the same info. There's plenty of time for that after we check out this elevator. Oh my god, don't do this to me. Oh my god, don't do this to me. Oh my god, it's gonna be another 40 fucking episodes. God, and you all voted for zero time don't want to be right after this? Really? God, I just want to die. I might need a break. The? I think the horror games are gonna be the break. Oh, this is just like the other floor. Okay, okay, okay. Now we're in a good like spot. We don't have a choice then. We gotta head back. Okay, good, 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 good. Quark, why don't you show them that note we found? Oh, thank the Lord. Sure. Oh? Did it say something like, supplementary rules? Because if it did, we found ours in the infirmary. Oh? Yeah, we found one too. It was in the safe in the lounge. Here are a few more rules. Okay, oh my god, okay. There so, is a lot of leeway here. This is the lounge. It would seem Zero's notes were telling the truth. And we went to the lounge this time instead of the crew quarters. Getting back here was easy enough. That means we could all go visit the infirmary too. Yeah, or the crew quarters. Hey, Grandpa, check this out. Uh oh, he wants a drink. Some of your favorite scotch. Oh my God. Oh, oh. Uh, tempting. I don't really think now's the time. Oh, it's always the time for alcohol. Whoa, hold on. Grandpa. Since when were they buddies? Why are they always been that close? Uh, in other words, they known each other before the Nonary game, and Quark was calling Tamioji Grandpa. Maybe they were related. Alice and Clover seemed to be close, too. Just how many of these people knew each other already? Let's go, buddy. As soon as we get out of here, you can drink all the root beer floats you can stomach. Ew. What? You're gonna get me a root beer float? But are are you sure? Uh what why is that bad? Do you have enough money? What does that mean? Oh ye of little faith. I found an old factory <clears throat> full of real <clears throat> metals the other day. Is he a Is he a thief? Is he a scavenger? Should I be worried about Tamioji and Quark? Also, ew, root beer floats, really? Oh, Mr. Kitty, I'm upset. I don't know why. 
Ah, uh, the one point. On the one hand, it's Mr. Kitty, and I love my kitty. But I'm working. Shit. This should be the same. <sighs> okay, yeah, perfect. So all this matches up the same. Kay, Quark, and myself each gave one card to Luna, Alice, and Timmy Oji. Then we headed into the AB rooms. There wasn't really any discussion if we go into which door, but Fee... Uh, yeah, Fee. Fee and I uh, found ourselves heading into the leftmost room, because it was Fila, right? I don't even remember! Uh, looks like everybody... blah blah blah, think we should head into... Why are you asking me? I am fucking Just asking. Just hurry up and get in good. there. Shut up, asshole. Okay, okay, fine. Fuck, whatever. Ah. Oh, you are so rude, lady. So, so uncaring, charismatic. And Ambedex Gate. Forty-five minutes remain. What? This game's got a time limit. What? 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 How? What? 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 What the fuck? Who is this? Fuck if I know. Look, it doesn't matter who she is. Just get everybody over here. Y y okay. Yeah. Right. God damn it. New timeline shenanigans. Uh, everyone, guys, get, uh, get over here. We found someone. There's, there's a lady in here. She's unconscious. Dio, don't try anything. I didn't wait for a response, just turned around and followed Fee into the room. We knelt down next to the woman and turned her over as gently as we man could manage. This was not in the original timeline. What the fuck is going on? All that greeted us was... What is happening? Uh, she's covered in blood. I leaned down to listen to her mouth. Nothing. No breath. With shaking hands, I felt against her neck for a pulse. No movement. Just cold skin. What? What? What the hell were you yelling at? Dude, was this you? What's going on here? D was this what? you? What is happening? Is she? Quark, uh, d don't look at this, buddy. Somebody get Quark the fuck out of here, please. Uh, okay. C come on, Quark. Then she's. Yeah, I guess. Yeah. She's not breathing and I can't find a pulse. Freddy's already cold, so I'm guessing she was... I'm guessing she was murdered a while ago? Murdered? Does this look like an accident or a suicide to you? Hmm. Looks like she was stabbed. Don't see a weapon around here, though. That means either the killer took it with them, or... It was part of them. It... What? Was it me? <laughs> My cybernetic arm killed this person. Part of them? Well, if someone was strong enough and they had metal hands, then they might be able to stab someone in the heart. Are you saying, Kay? What are you suggesting? Oh my god, Fee, why, what? It's just a joke. No, it's not. Shut up. Don't take it so seriously. I... Dark humor only exists in the real world, not in video games. Whatever. If we examine the wound, we'll probably get a better idea of what the weapon was. I... This is fucking wild. Let's get her to this the infirmary. didn't happen before. She might be old, but she's still a woman. If we're going to do an autopsy, she should have some privacy. Oh man, this is gonna fuck up everything. I'm not gonna be able to skip down here because there's gonna be another body in the infirmary with fucking Allison Cork. Come on, boys, let's go. God damn it!
D.O.K. and I gingerly lifted the woman up and carried her to the infirmary. Perhaps he just didn't consider himself one of the boys, or maybe it was something else. But whatever the reason, Tenmyoji only stared. He knows her. His little body was rigid like a rope pulled almost to its breaking point, but it was his eyes that caught my attention. He wasn't staring at us. Not quite. It was more like he was staring toward us, a smoldering spark of something burning silently behind his gaze. It wasn't until we were almost to the infirmary that I realized Hemioji hadn't spoken a single word since the moment we'd found the body. I turned to look back at him. He was following us at a distance, his breathing heavy and labored, and his movements slow and shuffling, as if his body was soundly made of lead. He knows her. That's his wife. Has to be his wife. Which means I am very much scared of Quark seeing the body. If that's his grandma, after all. God, I don't want to think that. The old woman's body was surprisingly light. Carrying her felt almost like carrying an old dry piece of wood. We set her down carefully in the infirmary. I... Okay. I not expecting that today. But I guess makes sense. They just delete all their fucking Yeah, they did. Cool. Uh the old woman's body was surprisingly like carrying her felt like carrying an old dry piece of wood. We sat her down carefully in the infirmary bed as if we were afraid she might break. Yeah, that's Tamioji's wife. She looks so peaceful. Almost like she's just going to wake up any minute now. Maybe she didn't suffer much when she died. Let's hope so. Anyway, I feel a little bad about doing this, but I think we need to examine her. Yeah. You mean like an autopsy or something? I'm just going to have a look at the wound. If we had a coroner, then it would be a different story, but... Luna! Um... Yeah! What? I have a medical license. You're a nurse? No. You're a doctor? Well, I'm not exactly a coroner. Interesting. I guess you really can't judge a book by its cover, can you? Sorry. You don't need to apologize. Are you really going to perform an autopsy? I would hope so. Oh, um... I won't really be doing it. I think that machine over there is a medical scanner. It's called an atom. It uses nuclear magnetic resonance imaging to examine and diagnose people. Ah, uh, yes, I remember. You remember? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, yeah? And just how the hell do you remember that? Because Alice, Clover, and I examined this entire room. Dumbass. Fuck you, Dio. <laughs> so you think you can use it to perform some kind of autopsy? Yes. I think I should be able to manage that. Okay. I mean, mysterious woman who wasn't in the other timeline, let's go. Luna ran the scanner over the body, then turned back to the terminal. The display filled up with text, most of it rather technical. Sex, female, estimated age 65 to 75 years old. Diagnosis deceased, cause of death. Exanguination? Estimate time of death, three to four hours. Damage trajectory. Weapon entered through fourth intercoastal piercing heart. Fuck. Wound characteristics. Wound margin, clean and continuous. Wound angles, one sharp, one blunt. Wound cavity, 150 millimeters. Wound length, 30 millimeters. Wound width, 3 millimeters. Conclusion. Based on the characteristics described above, there's a 95% chance the wound was caused by a sharp, single-bladed instrument. Huh. Yeah, I don't really get it. What's it mean by instrument? Was she stabbed with a clarinet or something? No, a fucking instrument normally means that 
the object in question. It means a tool of some sort. A knife, probably. In other words, she was stabbed in the heart, right? Yes. Well, I suppose that clears me of suspicion. Sorry, but no. Why? Please, don't tell me you think my hand can somehow turn into a knife. Oh my god, is this gonna become a lock right here? That's who killed the body? I told you that was a joke. Then why am I still a suspect? Because you can hold a knife? We found the old lady in one of the AB rooms, specifically the one farthest to the left. Before we went in there, only two other people had been in that room. You and Clover. Only one of you was conscious. Fi, please, stop joking around. I assure you, there was no one else in that room besides Clover when I woke up. She must have been put there later. But the door was locked, right? I don't think anyone could have gotten in without the key. Perhaps, but... Oh, somebody just gave a really good idea. I like that. I like that a lot. Somebody just suggested uh, for for the Twitch streams. I don't know when this is coming out, so it might already be implemented. But I'm trying to get people to help me figure out things for the notifications and everything. And uh, somebody just suggested, Toxie, this is you. A, uh, a be right back screen. You know, like if I have to take a piss break or something. And it'd be me hugging Pinky. There was a hatch on the ceiling, remember? Yes, there was. But Zero said he locked all the hatches. Well, if he was telling the truth, nobody could have gotten in there after you two left. Which means... You fucking bastard! Why'd you kill her, Kay? I knew it. You're him, aren't you? You're the real Zero! Wait a minute, please. Just calm down. You aren't making sense. Yeah, Dio. Oh my god, in this timeline, Dio is infected with Radical Six. I'm completely screwed. Let's suppose I am Zero. Why would I do something that would obviously cast suspicion on me? Uh, well, because... Yeah. Because you figured we'd think that. And you'd throw us off the trail by doing the exact opposite. That's not a logical argument. Still, you do have at least half a point. Your argument doesn't confirm my guilt. But it does show us where we should be looking. The real Zero. The person who brought us here is likely the person who murdered that woman. Doesn't that seem like the most reasonable answer? Still a little scared that Temi Oji's not saying anything. I guess. Yeah, that makes sense. I mean, okay, I just want to know. Lounge after escape. Crew quarters after escape. If Awful. Zero was the murderer then they could open anything they wanted to. I mean, didn't Zero say something about that? Oh, and that means all the electronic doors in this- We've done this, though. We've seen that Exactly. Bit. Also, consider this. If the murderer isn't Zero, why would the AI Zero stay silent? Because it's all part of the game. He told us that his job was to make sure the game ran smoothly. But now the unexpected has happened, and he says nothing. Why would he do that? If he can see everything we do, then he must know who killed the old woman. Alas, she was killed before he turned on. And it was inconsequential to the game. <laughs> it's always fun. So why has he kept his silence? The answer is simple. Because the butchers ain't shit. The murderer is Zero. Or rather, Zero Senior, I suppose you could say. Zero Senior, good lord. He likely ordered Zero Junior, the AI, to keep his identity hidden. Except we know it's Zero the Third. Didn't he say his name was that? If Zero Junior told why us about the murder, Why you all keep saying Junior? Then Zero Senior's identity would be compromised. There was something else to consider as well. Perhaps this murder was not unexpected. 
Zero Senior murdered her. Justice planned. Death is only another part of the game. Killing someone is just part of the game to him? Well, there's no way to know for sure, but I would assume so. Ten minutes remain until oh, oh, Abdex Game Polling closes. Alright, so the problem is I'm not going to be able to skip any of the infirmary scenes now because there's another corpse. All players, please enter your votes if no vote is... Wow, what was that? I don't know. Well, one thing's for sure. And that is... If we don't go vote, something bad's going to happen. You see, just as I said, Zero Junior ensures the game continues even though someone has died. All of this is part of Zero Senior's plan. Except, that would imply that it's June again, but a lot of bad shit's been happening. Let's get back to the warehouse. If we all head to the AB rooms, maybe we'll see Zero Junior. I mean, I would hope Akane is not doing After this. After all, he told us he'd give us specifics once we got in. I'd be in. very scared if Akane was the one doing this. What happened that made her into a psychopath, you know? Holy fuck! Holy shit! Ah, oh, we're really going in there? I kinda don't want to. I mean, there was a dead lady in there just a few minutes ago. Wait. Fifth. Five, where are you? Where'd you go? Up here. What? What? Up? Whoa! Uh, what the fuck are you doing up there? You must be really desperate to get high. Seriously? That's the best you can do? <laughs> I, I don't know. I was expecting something about how I jump at the first sign of trouble. Whatever. What are you up to up here anyway? Everybody's already gone into the AB yeah, rooms. Yeah, well, there was something I wanted to check out. And that is this thing. Remember it? The hatch. Try opening it. No luck. It won't budge. Hmm. Then that means this AB room is locked down tight. No one could get in. And yet, somebody escaped after a murder. You're talking about whoever killed that old lady, aren't you? Yeah. You still think it's gay, huh? Well, like Clover said, if Zero Senior is the killer, then it wouldn't matter if we could open this hatch or not. I know. I just wanted to be sure. Five minutes remain until Avidex game polling goes. So let me skip. Let's go. No. I imagine Algernon's waiting for us. The fuck does that mean? Uh, he's a rabbit. Can I make a guess and say that was a Watership Down reference? I've never seen or read that book Look. or movie or miniseries animated. There's something on the screen. Is there? <laughs> yeah, you're right. Is this gonna be the same? Of course not. Why would it be? That would be simple. Astute observation. Oh my god. <laughs> So we, we've got some questions for you, Zero. Who was that old wolf? Uh, will all of you please stop bombarding me with questions? All? The other people in the other rooms are asking me stuff just like you are, Siggy. I guess you probably can't hear them since these rooms are completely soundproof, but B.O. is especially loud. <laughs> <laughs> Dio is fucking screaming. For real, Dio. I need you to shut up. 
<laughs> I love this rabbit. There isn't much time. I gotta hurry and explain all this stuff, or the game will end before I'm done. So, no more questions from now on. Fine. Ooh, answers for anybody, okay? <gasps> you just have to wait. I don't wanna wait. Now, let's get this party started. Let me tell you. For example, Siggy oh my God. Out the me and went through the magenta door, didn't they? Yeah, we did. That means that Siggy and Fido will be playing against Mooney. Well, Fido, okay, five, 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 five. Like FIFA, I have to remember FIFA for fun. And it goes the other way too. Lily la la la. opponent will be Siggy and Fido. Obviously, that means potassium and Cleaver's enemy will be alas, and Bo and Quirk's enemy will be can be only. Okay, okay, so uh. Quirk and Tenmi OG are gonna do ally and ally because they're related. Uh, Clover and Alice are gonna do ally and ally because they're related. And I'm gonna do ally because Luna's a good girl. And I might not do that entire other timeline because it would be me. Well, I guess enemy isn't really the right word, is it? No, no, it is not. After all, if you choose ally, then there you are. Why? Um, okay, he explains then. the points. I think that about does it for the basic rules. Good. Actually, there's a little bit more. But. That can wait until later. Yeah, it'll just have to wait, I guess. After all. Meanwhile, there's a train behind me. Again, 426 AM. Fucking assholes. Hey! Wait! No! I won't wait and I can't wait! Didn't you hear me? It is time. It is time. One you must make other decisions. It is until time. Abadex game polling. You see, it's time for me to be hopping on out of here. <laughs> that old dusty trail. See you later. See ya, cutie. Have a nice trouble. <laughs> I love him. Or her. I don't know. We don't, I don't have time to talk about genders. this. I know they're wearing something like a chiogasm, but can't. So that doesn't mean anything to me. It could be a boy or a girl. It could be trans. It could be non-binary. I don't know. I'm not judging that bunny. Choose betray. What? Fuck off. No. Y you're fucking kidding. You really want me to betray Luna? We don't know if she'll ally or not. I think she will. If we choose ally and she chooses betray, we're screwed. That's a loss of two points. You tell me, Sigma. What's three minus two? One. What kind of idiot do you think I am? It's one. Stop, obviously. Exactly. If our BP gets down to so... Wait, what, what do you mean by it's over? 30 seconds remain until Ambidex game holy I'm picking an ally. Just press the damn button! You're fucking hiding something. Yeah, you've been suspicious from the get-go. I mean, how did you know my name? Or how about when we found that old lady's body? You didn't even blink. Almost like you knew she would be here. Look, I don't want to believe it. But did you? Are you? Fine. If you won't do it, then I... Don't think so. I'm not gonna move until you give me some answers. If I don't do anything, it'll just vote ally for us anyway. So let's hear it. What are you hiding? What's it's over supposed to mean? Ten seconds remain until Ambidex game polling closes. Is it seriously? Just don't do anything? Nine. Eight. Come on, seven, Fi. Six. Five. Come on, Fi. Four. Three, two, two. When your BP one. hit zero, you die. That's what I meant. One. Fuck you. Please be recorded. Please wait.
Round one of the Ambidex, Ambidex game has been has completed. Been... <laughs> I'm trying. Results A. will be displayed in the warehouse. Thank A. you for your participation. Ambidex Boop. gates now opening. Boop. Just to see. This is for future Phoebe. It's fine, I stepped out of the AB room. I could see the others running toward the monitor, shoving and pushing to get closer. Oh, fun, 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 fun. Ten Miyoji was left behind, his footsteps a slow, heavy pled, plod. What had happened to make him like that? What was that, Sigma? Huh? Don't play dumb. You chose Ally. Didn't you hear me? I told you that if your BP drops to zero, you die. Yeah, I heard you. A whole second before the deadline. How can you expect me to think anything through that quick? It would have taken like half a second just to process what you'd said. No, you could have done it. The brain's processing power increases during a crisis. Bitch, that's not how this works. I'm not, no, 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 don't get scientific on me, bitch. We're gonna get emotional. It starts working so fast that a second can seem like an eternity. <laughs> oh man, I've gotten there before. Your brain was doing that right before time ran out, wasn't it? Well, am I wrong? What the fuck are you talking about? Okay, fine. Let's be generous and say, hypothetically, that you're right about this crisis overclocking thing. How would you know whether or not my brain was doing that? Did you crack open my skull while I wasn't looking? You just wedged a microscope in there and had a look at my neurons? Let me be straight with you. Your shit is whack. Like... Hello, whack. I mean, you just know stuff you shouldn't. Stuff like my name, or how if your BP hits zero, you die. You told me you don't know why, but more and more I'm starting to think you've been lying to me. Yo, what's up? Siggy! I love you, Zero. Hey, what are you kids doing over there? Oh, bitching at each other about betray your ally. We're about to announce the result. Which means I should be able to skip this because we did this last time, too. Let's go. Time to see what the results are. Maybe uh -oh. it's different this time. There was no other. It's been. It was with Alice. Oh my god, the fucking future justifies the past or interacts with the past. Luna, no, no, Luna, you didn't. You didn't. Huh? This time. Fuck, fuck. Hold on. Shit. Good, good, good. <laughs> Looks like you're all here. Let's get ready to rock! Ambidex okay. one! The yep. If everybody would please direct their eyes to this monitor. It's not gonna be good. It's not gonna be good for me. This will be. What is it? Ally, ally. Whoa! Oh my god, what? Cork betrayed his grandfather and Clover betrayed Alice. That... I thought this was going to be a straight ally the entire way through. This is the worst timeline. Here are the results from your game. Holy shit. Now, let us check the numbers on our bracelets. Oh my god, what the fuck just happened? Alice and Tenmyoji, how the fuck did that happen? 
How the fuck did that happen? I, I kind of tempted to end here. I don't know what else to do or say. Thanks, Luna. Oh, no, it's nothing. You don't have to thank me. No, I think I do. You're the only person who was a solo who picked Ally. I only did what anybody would have done. Or, I guess, wait, all the solos picked Ally. We were the only pair that picked... What is happening? I believed in you and Fi. When Luna glanced away, I threw Fi what could only be described as a smug grin. Rather frustratingly, she didn't respond, only turned away unperturbed. I was about to press the issue when I heard Temioji's voice. Uh-oh. Quark, what happened? No, no, it wasn't me! Mr. Dio tricked me! Oh my god, he said he was gonna pick Ally. Oh my god, Dio, what the fuck? He told me he'd pick Ally! He, he, he promised! That's why I let him do the voting! Oh my god, what the fuck is this? Is this true, Dio? Are you serious? This kid's full of shit. I should be one of your asses. I should be both of your asses, just to make sure. What? what? I didn't do squat. Quark was the one who decided how we were going to vote. Oh my god. You want to know what he told me? You just leave the voting to me, Mr. Dio. Grandpa's gonna choose to ally for sure, cause I'm his opponent on this one. I think we should betray What is happening in this awful, awful timeline? To be honest, I'm getting kinda tired of that grumpy old bastard. <gasps> My god! What is happening? He just promised you a root beer float. I do not believe this. He's had a good life, but it's time for him to go. <clears throat> I almost spat out my water. Holy shit. What do you say we leave the old bar here and leave? This isn't Quark. That was 100% Dia. I've got a plan. See? Don't worry about me. This was Dio. I'll just tell him you tricked me. This is Dio. Don't believe whatever I tell him. This is Dio. If he still trusts me, that'll make it easier to use him again later. Oh my god. What do you say, Mr. Dio? Oh my god, what the fuck, Dio? Pretty good plan, huh? Wait a minute. That's one of the kids from uh, Ultra Despair Girls. It's the same actor, isn't it? All right, let's do it. Is that the fucking Frankenstein kid? You, the art you're kid? You're lying! I never should have trusted you! Dio! You're a lying jerk! Sure, kid. Keep whining. See if I care. Oh my god. Somebody kick his ass. Grandpa! You believe me, right? Don't let this brat fool you, old man. All of this is just part of his plan. This is fucked up. I don't know. I think it's Dio, but it could be either way. You bastard! Oh, no, he swore. I'm, I'm no longer on his side. I'm not gonna let you get away with this! <sighs> That's enough, Quark. Don't lose your temper. Oh, he believes. How long have I known you? <laughs> I could be deaf and blind, and I'd still know if you were lying to me. Really? <laughs> You're just as gullible as he said you'd be. Hook, line, and sinker. Let me give you a little warning, Tenmyoji. That little shit is a hell of an actor. I'll bet you money he's a born con man. I don't know what he is to you, but if I were you, I'd trust the kid as far as I could throw him, and at your age, that can't be much. Oh my god, Dio, shut the fuck up. You hearing me, old man? Keep an eye on him. Fuck off. But also keep an eye on everybody. It's all right. Adia. I understand. You snapped at me. You don't get to. You, you don't know me, and you snapped at me. You know Clover, and you're like, nah, nah. It's good, fam. No, 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 no. I'm so sorry. 
I apologize. This is very unfortunate. No, this is bullshit. Why did I get the freak out? They know each other. It looked as though another argument had taken place while Cork and Dio were fighting. Why did I say that like Xavier, Renegade, Angel? Whatever it had been, it appeared to have resolved itself. The past is the I past. hate that show. There's no point complaining about it. I'll just have to try and get those points back in the next AB game. No, we could all just pick Ally. Zero, when does the next round start? What makes you think we'll be having another round? Okay, that question was a repeat, which means this should be able to be skipped. Well. Perfect. See? See, I'm recognizing. I know what I'm going with. I know what's happening. So, oh my god, imagine if I had to do this as a fucking... This would have been the full episode. Hey, uh, it changed. Mine changed from red to cyan. Me too. Mine's cyan now. I'm paired with... I could get her four points. I could get her four points. I really want to know why that's just one square. It can't be me dying because I'm at five. This is okay. No, 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 no. Give me a second. Math, math. I am currently in a good position. I went up. Alice is good. So how does one happen? Mine too. I'm with Alice and Clover, and Clover is a solo. Oh boy. Okay. Um. Um. So ally again, right? It's not gonna matter, even if I do betray. Wait, hold on. If we do ally and they betray, we lose, and then Alice would die. And oh god, this is just gonna get more complicated. Wait, I guess the colors weren't the only thing that changed. It switched from pair to solo. You're right. Mine switched from solo to pair. Mine is now a solo as well. Yep, looks like mine's changed too. Tell me he's with Dio. I've gone from solo to pair. Tell me he's with Dio. I'm still a pair. Okay, okay. So the good boys are all together. The three of us seem to be magenta now as well. I'm okay with that. I'm yellow. Oh no! Fucking Luna's with. No! It still says solo. Fine, you and Dio are yellow now too, right? No! Okay, Fi, you have crazy bullshit, you can jump. I need you to kick Dio in the back of the head so that way you can vote ally and keep Luna in the game. As in, don't do Betray. We literally just figured out in this timeline that at least we're the good guys. You can continue the trend. Yeah. Looks like I'm a pair. He sounds when so happy change? about it. Back when the AB gates closed. Okay, so everybody has their relative colors. Big huge flashback. My fucking car did all crazy shit. And, uh, oh god, we're still skipping. Why is this happening to me? I spent a few minutes wallowing in misery. I figured I deserved at least a little self pity. But I, even I knew that brooding and whining wasn't going to get me anywhere. Like Kay had said, we need to at least try and find another way out. So I shook my head to clear it, stood up straight, and headed off. Oh god, really? This again? Oh my god. This is the worst. This was like two episodes. Tell me I can skip some of it. Oh, Sigma. Oh, tell me Perfect I can skip timing. some you were of this here shit. Earlier, right? Oh my god. <laughs> yeah, I was. Phylon and I were the first into this room. Okay, at the very least, the infirmary should stay the same. 
simply for the fact that we didn't do it both times. Did you find anything suspicious? Uh, like, uh, like a secret, secret pathway, pathway or something? <laughs> uh, you really think that's the kind of detail I would have neglected to mention? Anything else then? Anything out of the ordinary? Out of the ordinary? Uh... Well, I mean, everything about this room is fucking out of the ordinary. How about this? Isn't that obvious? It's an astronomy magazine. Apparently, it's got an article about a lunar eclipse. It said it's going to happen on December 31st, 2028. This New Year's Eve, then? Yeah. Six days from now. Wait, what did you say? What do you mean, six days? Uh, well, today's Christmas, right? So... Wait a minute. You were all taken at different times. You were all frozen. When were you grabbed? Didn't you... On Christmas! About two or three in the morning? Wait, did they pick you up on a different day? Yeah. I was abducted in the middle of the night on December 22nd. What about you? I... Uh, I think it was the 20th. Then we were all taken on different days. Does that mean we were just sleeping until the honorary game started? Maybe they kept us on a Soparil IV drip or something? In theory, you could have everyone wake up at the same time if you got the dosage right. Then today might not even be the 25th. I think that's likely. Yeah. Some of us were probably abducted after you. Oh. Well. I guess that explains why I feel kind of dizzy. You too? I felt disoriented since I woke up. My body doesn't feel right. Maybe it's because we were asleep for so long. Your muscles start to atrophy if you don't use them. I'm still hearing Vincent Law whenever I speak to Dio. Uh, and I just want to watch Argo Proxy again. That might be one of my favorite animes of all time. That's not even a joke. I saw it in the last year. It might be one of my favorites. It's that, Trigun, Digimon, just like Digimon in general, Princess Tutu, fucking, uh, Tanty and Stalking. But Ergo Proxy's just, ooh, ooh. Then, what day is today? Beats me. I have no idea. Well, what about you guys? Was there anything interesting in the crew quarters or the infirmary? Nah, nothing in the quarters. Oh well, there was a book about a cat. A cat? Yeah. Something about a cat in a box and whether it's dead or alive. Huh? Schrodinger's? Didn't make any sense to me, though. Of course it didn't. You're an idiot. Huh. Well, it doesn't really sound like something that's going to help us get out of here. Yeah, I didn't think so either. How about you, the... I was about to say, how about you? How about the infirmary? As... The house... The apartment started humming. Find anything interesting? Well... Actually, there was one thing. What? I wasn't trying to hide it. The right moment to mention it just never came up. You don't need to apologize. Just tell us what you found. Well, see for yourself. It's a newspaper article, looks like. Yeah, it was in the safe in the infirmary. Let me see that. Radical 6 infection spreads. Cure continues to elude authorities. What the fuck? What's Radical 6? Just read the article. I have read the article. The Radical 6 virus continues to spread across the globe like wildfire. The WHO has confirmed that they won't be fooled again, that the death toll is estimated to have passed 100,000 victims. Immediate quarantine of any infected patients is strongly about. I, uh, I just realized something extremely important. That, like, extremely important, because he doesn't know what Radical 6 is, but he got taken on the latest day between all three of them. 
They never mentioned the year. I guess, though, the magazine and him saying six days from now actually matters. Do you think we're in a quarantine facility? You mean you think we got infected with this Radical Six thing? Oh, come on, you gotta be kidding me. Well, we don't know anything for sure. But look at us. We seem pretty healthy. Admittedly, I don't know what the symptoms of Radical Six are. But if it's killing people worldwide, they must be horrific. Now, just look at this soft, lustrous skin. Oh my god, Alice. This perfect, shapely face. Alice! Does this beauty look like something infected with an awful disease? Yes, because I read uglies and pretties. So, I never read specials though. But, point still stands that yes, I think you have been manipulated in some way. You want to touch it, don't you, boy? One, not a boy. Two, you have no idea what I'd do to you. I can see it in your eyes. No, you can't. You're virtual. Go on. Try. Oh my god. Alice, don't do this to me. <laughs> Dio's just looking at her with the fucking Mr. Bill oh no face. <laughs> Well, I am feeling a little weird. That could just be from sleeping for a couple of days. Or maybe it's a side effect of that drug. Uh, besides, if this is where they ship people to quarantine them, don't you think there aren't enough, uh, people? This thing is killing people all over the world, right? Yeah, that's what we got told. Why is there not a new black hole? On we go doesn't update until tomorrow, but Black Hole still hasn't updated. I'm getting angry. So why would there only be nine of us here? Yeah, I guess you do have a point. Freebie, you read such awful things? Dude, Demon Candy Parallels is on my bookshelf. Shut the fuck up. Think about it. I looked at Tyga, the VTuber's uh, YouTube earlier, right before recording. And I just looked at half of the thumbnails and went, I know that artist, I know that artist, I know that artist. I follow that artist, I know that artist. I've been on the internet for 20 years. You can, oh, okay, let's rephrase. I've been on the internet for longer, but I've known about porn and stuff for 18 years. I was in sixth grade. I think I've said this on a stream or something, but aristies.com. Zero is forcing Don't go us to there play now. this nonary like game. A virus utopia. Why would the government quarantine people and then make go them play a game? Go on Jalboro or something. Also a good point. Yes, it is. So you're saying there's no connection between our abductions and this virus? Probably not. Huh. Well, it's still something we should remember, I suppose. Okay, Beatrice, calm down. I mean, even if we're safe... Uh, you know what? I'm gonna do the Beatrice voice. I mean, even if we're safe in here, our friends and families are still out there, I suppose. That's true. I cannot do her. I hope they're alright. I wanna cosplay her, though. It's Re-Zero, uh, re by the way. Wait a minute, when did this virus actually show up? I've never heard of it before. Neither have I. Me either. So what day is it? If this Radical Six killed hundreds of thousands of people while we were asleep, just how long have we been here? I don't think you'll be able to just puzzle that out. If we want the truth, we need to find more information. Did the fucking virus come from the lunar eclipse? I'm being serious. It's an honest question. Did I just get Andromeda strained? Uh, I think I'll go look around a bit more then. Wait, Evil Moon. What's Evil Moon? Channel 44? Channel 4. Local 44. No. What is it? 44 was the thing that was going to be the Slenderman spinoff, or the, the, the Marble Hornet spinoff before Ekva happened. What is the one that Chris Straub did? Uh, Alice and I are going to stick around. I can't remember. You know, just in case you miss something. 
Don't really feel like I can trust your eyes. Whatever. I turned and headed for the exit. Where to next? I guess. I should end soon. I should. But I don't want to be stuck in this square for another eight years like we did last time. Because that was fucking stupid. Also should eat. I'm thinking burgers. Oh. oh my god. Ah. Oh, okay, fuck this. Next time. On... Let's play Virtue's Last Reward. Continuing down this hellhole of a path. Oh! And stretching. Stretching is good. Wait, do those actually end at another game? Oh god, it's another six endings. Okay. Oh god. Alright. Yeah, this. Hold on. This. The fact that that went, that this goes from a book into another book makes me think that this is the true ending path. Especially since this is Fi's bad ending. And Fi is the only person like me, so I think keeping them alive is kind of like the Junpei Akane thing going on this, in this game. But that being said, I am curious as to what this timeline I really want to know what this is, but I guess we're going relatively down that path, so we'll find out. And this should sync up with pretty much everything over here. It should still be Alice getting infected and Cork freaking out. So, should be fine. Should be fine. So next time, concerned that we're in the infirmary and Quirk is also in the infirmary and there's a dead body here, I guess we'll find out if Quirk knows who the body is or not. Maybe it's Grandma. Maybe Temi Oji married this girl. Knows this girl. I don't know. But hey, if you want to find out and you, you don't already, you should subscribe so that way when the next episode comes out, you're aware of it. You could like and comment, you could dislike. It's whatever. Do whatever you need. Just interact. Have a good time. Show us that you are willing to at least interact a little bit. There's a Patreon, a Twitch, and a Twitter link in the descriptions below. They all help a lot. I'm on a lot of podcasts every once in a while. Game World 40. Games my mom found. Uh, the Leadest. You should follow those guys. You should also listen to uh, Magecast, Nerds Without Pants. New Dad Gaming, Retro Game Club, Gamers Week Podcast. You should listen to all those guys. They're all super cool people. And finally, I hope you have a good rest of your day. Time. Of day. Whatever time it is. I'm the Let's Play Princess signing off. Peace and love to you all. As always. <laughs>